Hey guys, this is Dolan with Poe Productions. We're going to go over the PlayStation Eye camera and modifications that we have available here at the store. PlayStation Eye has gotten renewed interest now because of the Sony Move controllers that have come out. And basically the main application that we sell them for is people using them for optical tracking in multi-touch setups. Uh, the first one we're going to start with is the OEM modification on the OEM lens. You have your standard OEM lens here where you can see the infrared blocking filter. This is the good version. The bad version is this one, where you can see it's actually bigger. Definitely looks different. If you turn them over, you can see how the good lens has a curved surface, whereas the bad lens has a flat and slightly whiter looking piece of glass there. This one, the bad one, is unmodifiable. If you were to go and try and take that thing out there, you would destroy the whole lens. This one though, you can take that Peace out, I've already made a video showing that, and as a result, you get this. You can see the cutout using a knife, exacto blade, no more filter. Taking this, you basically put in an OEM uh, filter, red side, black side, black side, always to the sensor, no matter what lens you're working with. Here you're looking at the OEM modified camera. This is the video output from the camera. As you can see, the image is very fuzzy, out of focus. This is due to the inability for the lens to be twisted and adjusted. It does have, as you can see, two field of view clicks. Besides the OEM modified camera, we also have the addition of the M12 mount modification which allows better lenses and better filters to be applied to the camera board. Now we're going to take a look at the M12 mount cameras. Taking the OEM case out, we're able to adapt onto it an M12 mount. Inside you can see a filter, two screw holes on the bottom, simple to attach. So you can buy the camera like this, or you can buy it with the pieces that are disassembled, or you can buy it all assembled together with the OEM case. So this is the M12 mount with the filter inside the original casing that came on the camera. I've also created a custom acrylic case for the M12 camera, and see again the mount with the filter inside there has screw holes, magnets, hold the lid on camera itself can be situated in the horizontal or vertical position allows it to be mounted slimmer than the OEM case which is really important when you're mounting it onto the bottom of a box or such in the infrared tracking setups. As you can see, this thing has a stand, which can get in the way, and the cable. So if you try and put it down flat, it is really hard to. This one, basically, super flat, or this way, whichever way you want to do it. This is a video output from an M12 setup with an M12 lens filter and mount. You can simply focus the image as you can see by turning the lens, allowing for any field of view to be perfectly focused. You can change the field of view by adapting different lenses. This is a higher distortion 2.1 millimeter lens, which is why the edges are curved. Besides the M12 lens standard in the CCTV industry, there's also CS lenses and C lenses. CS lenses are much more important because you can simply use an adapter ring to put a C lens onto a CS mount. We found some super wide angle CS lenses that didn't have any distortion, so we decided to create a CS mount for the PlayStation Eye camera. Using the same M12 lens mount that we had created before, we adapted a larger CS lens threading onto it. This is the new CS mount. Basically, you can see it threads into a CS lens, has a standard M12 mount base, 
and the filter comes in from the bottom and it's held there. Pretty easy to adapt a CS lens in. You just screw it on in just like a standard lens. And there's the lens itself. These lenses typically are verifocal, so they rotate to extend. Assembled cameras that we sell with these mounts are the custom acrylic cases with a larger hole here for the wider mount. You can see the filter inside. Magnets again, same as the M12 setup, just a bigger hole for the camera mount. Those are the cameras available from Poe Productions. If you'd like to contact us, you can use the live chat or email form through the store website, or you can reach us directly at Skype or Gmail chat under the username Poe Productions, all one word. Thanks for watching, and good luck on your projects.